So in part B, no big surprise here, they ask you to predict. So they tell you that temperature is 15 degrees Celsius, what's N, what's the number of visitors? And again, it helps to just have written this equation down, I think that really helps you to know what to do. Because if N equals all of this stuff right here, then what you can do is just put in, it's almost too easy, you just use this equation. Of course, there's some other clever calculator ways of doing it. You can put it in as a table values or put in a line and ask your calculator for the uh, position on this line. But I mean, I prefer to just put in the numbers straight away here like this. So just go 667 times 15 plus 22.2. And if I do that on my calculator, let's see what I get here. So I'm going to go uh, maybe to another page because I'd like to do a calculation here. And I'm just going to do that. So 0.667 times 15 and I like to always press enter and then just say answer plus this there it goes so it's 32.205 which ends up now you have to think very carefully now if you just put in this what was it again 32.205 is this really an answer that makes sense could it really be 32.2 visitors uh no so you have to round it down so in this case you could say fine then n equals 32 visitors that's because you can't have half visitors or decimal videos, visitors. So it does help to think about the units of your answer and think about if it makes any sense, if you need to round up or down. In this case right here, we should round down because we have a little bit more than 32 visitors, but we have 32 entire visitors. We don't have 33. You see, even if it was 32.9, I wouldn't say it was 33 visitors. Right? You just have to round it down. So, well, we have 32. We don't have enough to have 33 visitors. In this case here, I think you should always round down. No matter what your answer was here, I think you should always round it down. So there you go. Linear regression questions are very, very common on exams. And as long as you know how to do it on your calculator, they can be a real snap. Right? You just got to learn how to do the regression. You got to recognize usually something with R. They don't always ask you about that, but they sometimes do. But they pretty much always ask you about predicting with your equation.